start off with a sponge this metallic purple face paint coming from the corner of my eye up to like the center of my eyebrow and a bit further up and then underneath right at the outer corner of the eye um, and going from the center of the eye outwards. I then went into this metallic pink paint and I carried on the shape going upwards to create the top butterfly wing and then the bottom as well you want to kind of send the wing outwards away from the eyes a bit. I then puffed on some spray glitter as if you do it while the paint's still wet it really sticks and looks super glittery. I then outlined the wings with a black face paint and to create this shape around the edge you just want to have fun and be creative, push down and wiggle, it doesn't have to be too perfect and then you just drag it in and that creates the thin lines. For the bottom wing you want to start kind of in the centre of your eye and have it coming out at about a 45 degree angle. I then painted on the centre of the butterfly's body by doing a dot and then a longer line underneath and then just adding some curly antennae. I then went into this white face paint and by applying different pressures you can create different size dots and this just looks super pretty and just ties the design together. I then like to add a bit of chunky glitter to the design and this is Barefoot Glitter. It's a new biodegradable glitter brand and they sent me a few different samples and it's honestly so nice. I'll link the website for it down below. So I just popped on some aloe vera gel and then just added a bit of chunky pink glitter around the design. And this is the finished design, it literally takes a few minutes to do. I had this on my design board at a festival last weekend and it was super popular. All the little girls really loved it and it's really simple and easy to do. I actually find butterflies quite difficult for such a simple thing so I'm just trying to perfect my design as well but I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. Bye!